Hey, first grade mystery reader. Today is Brady reading chapter four. What's chapter four called, B? Freako. Freako. Here, here's a Freako. Gordon. Okay, Brady. Okay. I ran and ran all over the house. Oh no, I shouted. Oh no, uh oh no. My grandpa Frank Miller knocked my tooth out. My grandpa Frank Miller knocked my tooth out. Grandpa ran after me. No, I didn't. Of course I didn't. Junie B, he said. Your tooth came out when you bit down on my finger. I kept running and shouting. I look like Uncle Lou. I look like Uncle Lou. Help, help, help. I look like Uncle Lou. I zoomed to the front door and opened it wide. 911, 911. My tooth's knocked out. My tooth's knocked out. Grandpa quick, Grandpa quick picked me up and carried me and me back inside. <coughs> then he took me to the bathroom and he gave me a paper cup with water rinse and spit he said I did what he said only that's when the worstest thing of all happened because my spit water turned pink I did a gasp in, su in that site at that site <laughs> blood blood there's blood in my spit I hollered some more grandpa Miller covered his ears please Junie B just stop the screeching after that, he took an aspirin. Plus, also, he ate two tums. I kept on rinsing and spitting. Then finally, my spit water turned regular. Woo, I said. That was a close one. I was almost out of blood. Grandpa bent down next to me and smiled. Well, let's have a look, he said. I opened my mouth for him. He looked and did a chuckle. He then lifted me up the mirror so I could see too. I quick closed my mouth again because I was nervous to see myself, of course. My tongue felt my tooth hole. It felt very roomy in there. Well, said Grandpa, Grandpa Miller, aren't you going to look, honey? It looks cute, Junie B. It really does. My heart pounded and pounded. Then, fast as a wink, I opened my lips. And I did a little peek at my mouth. I quick closed my eyes again. Because what do you know? A freako. So she thought she looked like a freako. Yep. Put me down, Grand Grandpa, I said. Put me down right now. I don't want to look at myself again. I don't, I don't, I don't. Grandpa Miller put me down. Just then my nose started to sniffle very much, and my eyes got tears in them. I hate me, I said. I hate the way I look. Grandpa blew my nose on toilet paper. I'm never going to look at myself again, I said. Never, ever, ever, never. And I mean it. Grandpa bent down next to me again. I want you to listen to me, little girl, he said. I would never lie to you, Junie B. You look every bit as cute without your tooth as you did with it. He gave me a hug. Your new smile is wonderful, he said. You didn't even give it a chance, honey. You really need to look at it again, honest, you do. He ruffled my hair. Do it for me, okay? Just give yourself one more chance. I rocked back and forth on my feet very slow because I needed to think this over, that's why. Finally, I did a big breath. Okay, Grandpa, I said, if you really want to lift me up there again, I guess I will let you, but I'm only doing this to be nice. Grandpa Miller patted my head. You're very kind, he said. After that, he lifted me back up to the mirror. Very slow, I opened my mouth again, and I peeked at my new tooth hole. Try smiling, said my grandpa. You'll love your new smile. I know you will. I did a nervous breath, and I smiled at myself kind of shy. See, said Grandpa Miller. See how cute it looks? That's what she looks like smiling in the mirror. Okay. I didn't answer him. Instead, I made another face at myself, and then another one, and another one. Pretty soon, I tried every face in the book. Finally, Grandpa winked at me. So what do you think, little girl? He said, hmm, how do you think you look? I smiled kind of shy again. I think I look fascinating, Frank, I said. Grandpa Miller put me back on the floor, then he went to the kitchen, and he got a stool. He brought it back to the bed bathroom. He helped me up to the top step. I stared at myself till mother came home. And that's chapter four, Freaka. What's chapter five called? 
The fairy. <clears throat> Tooth fairy. No, the fairy. The fairy. Yeah. Okay. Maybe it looks like you put G to sleep. Mm. You're welcome. Thanks, Brady. Great mystery reader. Yeah.